I'm back. Today's video is Face Mask Friday. We are back with Face Mask Friday. I thought it would be fit to bring it back now towards the end of the year because I wasn't really in the space to do it throughout the year, but now I'm back. And honestly, my inspiration was this right here. There's also Heavenly Five Days of Superfood Face Care Daily Face Mask Glow Kit with Vitamin C. Now, of course, I won't be doing them every single day because then we wouldn't have a video for each month of Face Mask Friday. So I'm going to try all five masks out on camera, but on separate videos. So I hope you guys enjoy this and I hope that you get back into the group Face Mask Friday with me and that we can really, really continue to grow our face mask Fridays. Let's get right into it, guys. So, guys, this um, pack contains these five masks, each of them serving a different purpose. So today, I've decided that I'm going to try out the Superfood Face Care Detoxifying Mud Facial Mask boosted with turmeric and Dead Sea Minerals. It's a purifying mask with vitamin C. All of them, guys, have vitamin c as you can see that logo on the bottom so i will be trying out this one it's random selection so in the next video it's also going to be random selection depending on whatever i feel like using so this mask is meant to cleanse pores and purify skin with this multitasking mud mask boosted with powerful spoofers to help rejuvenate skin leaving with a healthy feeling glow with Dead Sea Minerals and Aloe Vera known to help to remove impurities and absorb excess oils, infused with rejuvenating vitamin C and antioxidant rich turmeric to leave skin feeling restored, feed skin only based ingredients. So why I want to try this one out specifically is because of the vitamin C, the dark marks on my face, forehead, underneath my eyes, etc. And secondly, that um the Dead Sea Minerals that are going to help with absorbing the oil on my skin. I absolutely need that because I get pimples here, especially, and here in my T-zone, really, because I have oil in those areas, but the rest of my face is super, super dry. So, yeah, guys, this is actually the Day 5 mask. Looking at these masks, you're supposed to do them in the order. So, if you are somebody who wants to try these masks out, then you can do them day 1, day 2, day 3. All the way until day five but i'm not doing it in that order i'm just deciding like i said random selection whichever one i feel like doing so i'm gonna go wash my face now and then do the mask and then give you guys my review so guys i have just washed my face you can see my brows completely removed and my baby hairs look a bit funny now but it is what it is i'm gonna put the mask on now unfortunately i can't find my brush that i usually use to put my mask on so i'm just gonna use my fingers um they are clean so it says smoother layer on to clean skin avoiding eyebrows hairline lips and eye area leave on for 15 to 10 minutes then rinse off with warm water and that is exactly what i'm gonna do now
fishy kind of tying the mask. It's burning a little bit over here. I don't know why, but it is burning. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes, then I'll remove it and then come back and give you guys my review. So guys, I just want to give a disclaimer. Face Mask Friday is strictly for myself. I love face masks, I love self-care. I'm not a medical professional, I'm not a dermatologist, so I am not telling you to go try these. I'm just recommending them if you're interested in trying these. My skincare journey is trial and error, so everything that I do on this channel is all the things that I'm trying to get the perfect skin. So, and whatever perfect is to me, you know? So I don't want anybody bashing me or getting angry saying I'm giving the wrong advice, etc, etc. That's not what I'm here for. I'm just here to have a good time and to show you guys what I'm doing for myself. And if you want to try those things out, even with my shower routines or anything, feel free. But this is not an advice channel. It's simply just for a good time and to try new things out for myself and on myself. So yeah, here we go guys and I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay guys, so I'm back. And I must say, it wasn't too difficult to wash off, but I did have a lot, a lot of tingling on my face when I had the mask on. But after the first five minutes, it went down and it wasn't tingling so much anymore. My skin feels relatively smooth. I haven't yet applied any cream on my face or toner or anything of that sort. So I don't know how it will be tomorrow when I wake up in the morning, you know, but I really do like this mask. I never have anything negative to say about mud masks because they're generally my favorite. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. And I think my skin looks relatively, you know, clean and smooth and not as pale as I looked because I think when I first put on the mask, I did look pretty pale. So. I must say I look less pale, a little bit more life in my face. So yeah, I am happy with it. And um, there's a generous amount in the small little sachet. So I will be using it throughout the week um, so it doesn't go to waste and seeing if I get the same results or even better results as the week goes. But anyway, guys, thank you so, so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next Face Mask Friday. Bye.